The unveiling occurred uh, yesterday morning about 9 o'clock. Uh, very excited by uh, the farmers all around it. Uh, within two seconds uh, of saying, enjoy the show, I'm pretty sure uh, there were six people around every single row unit, and there were parts flying in the air with people trying to figure out how this machine works. Uh, reaction is, has been very, very positive. Uh, a lot of farmers excited about John Deere taking uh, planting to the next step. So for the exact emerge row units, the row units are electrified. There's two motors. One motor drives the, uh, drives the meter. The second motor drives the delivery system. The reason for that is we want independence between the delivery and the metering so that you can have an infinite number of population and you have an infinite number of uh, options as far as speed matching to the ground. It's 56 volt system for the motors, uh, which provides us with uh, a, a low current going across the, uh, the machine. Power source for the electric drive is a, a hydraulically driven generator that's located on the back of the machine. Uh, it is uh, uh, driven off the uh, hydraulics of the tractor. Uh, it utilizes about the same hydraulic flow as today's VRD motors. Uh, so uh, from that standpoint, as far as the hookups, it's two hydraulic hoses and moving forward. The Maximers 5 row units are still our uh, standard cable driven and chain driven machines. From a, from a standpoint of uh, the exact emerge row unit, we are bringing in industry first and that's the ability to singulate soybeans. Uh, so today's C-tube technology is a flat disc that uh, provides three or four rows of seeds falling down the seed tube at, at once. With the new exact emerge row unit, uh, we have provided the ability to singulate soybeans in the trench. This offers several uh, potential uh, uh, benefits to the customer. Uh, one is the ability for potential uh, of better yields. Uh, the second is the potential of uh, being able to uh, drop populations because you're going to get more out of every seed. In the agriculture.com forum, we had a few questions about weight. The weight of this planter is exactly at the same weight as the one today. We've also had questions about the size and models. With Exact Emerge, it will be available as an option on our 1775 NT and our 1795. Our 1775 is sold in 12 row, which is a 30 foot, 16 row, which is a 40 foot, and 24 row, which is a 60 foot. All those are 30 inch machines. For our 1795, we have a 23, 24 row, 15 inch, which is a 30 foot machine. We have our 24 row, 20 inch, which is a 40 foot machine. And we have our 31, 32, 15 inch, which is a 40 foot machine. The planning windows seem to get tighter every year, uh, you know, whether it's weather conditions or time constraints, family, whatever, we seem to have to get over more acres uh, quicker. So speed is an issue, uh, you know, the, generally the faster the better, but it's got to be done right uh, when, to increase that speed. You can only plant once a year, so if you don't get that right depth and spacing, you know, the first time, you don't get another chance till next year, so it's very important. Also, I think it cuts a lot into your profit margin. I mean, if you're not getting good stands, you're not making good money. I mean, it comes right down to it. Yeah. Speed for us is we have very rocky, rocky soil, hilly. Uh, we're lucky to get five mile an hour. To, so to see 10 miles an hour, it'd be great to see in our area to cut our planting time in half, but I'd like to see it.